What's up everybody, Coach Mike here. In today's video, I'm gonna be introducing to you the three pillars that I believe are vital to you being successful in your training goals. Whether you're training for rehab, from injury or pain management, or you're a general fitness enthusiast for health and wellness or aesthetic goals, or lastly, you're an athlete and you have performance oriented goals, these three things are vital to you being successful. Number one, commitment. To be successful at your training goals, you need to be committed to both your lifestyle and your training. You can't be one without the other. You need that balance of both in order to really achieve what you want to. It's okay if you don't have balance in both, like you still train, but you're still doing the wrong things outside of training. As long as you understand that, you're probably not really gonna ever reach those goals. If you really want to, at some point or another, you're going to have to, for an extended period of time, sacrifice and do the right things in your lifestyle and also your training. The second thing, which goes along hand in hand with that, it's really hard to split the two, is consistency. With consistency, it's really about making sure that you're consistent in not only turning up, but also putting in effort. You've got to follow the plan, you've got to do the one percenters, right? It's okay if every now and then you're not perfect, but majority of the time, 95%, you have to really be consistent with everything you're doing. You've got to have the right intensity. You've got to hit everything that's programmed for you. You've got to do the extra. You've got to recover. You've got to sleep well, okay? Being consistent with these things regularly, making your meals on time, getting the right calories in and out, is vital to the success of your goals. And it cannot be done finally without a supportive environment. Why? Because at times life throws spanners in the works, which means you're going to drop off a little bit somewhere with something, whatever it is, a stress with your uh, work, job or family. Uh, that is when having a supportive environment and people around you that understand what you need and, and what's going on with everything that's around you is vital. So that comes in twofold, having the right supportive environment at, at home and around you with your friends who know what you're trying to achieve and get behind you and you know jump in with you to achieve those targets. Also having a supportive environment where you train, the people, the community, and the coaches that look after you. By having that and putting that in place, it typically helps you to be better at these things. Why? Because someone along the line is gonna give you the advice in order to overcome those plateaus. Yes, there are other things that are vital to the success of your training goals, but I find that these three things here have really stood out to me when I have seen people from all of these avenues achieve what they want to. But I've had athletes achieve at the highest level when they have been committed, they're consistent, and they've got the right people around them. What tends to happen is people drop off when something's out of whack of these three things. That's it for today. Hopefully that inspires you to want to be more committed, more consistent, and find a supportive environment in order to achieve what you're trying to achieve. Watch out for more videos to help you overcome training plateaus. Um, anything that you want to know, also please reach out, message, comment below, and I'll do a video and do my best to help you out. Thanks for watching. Da, 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 hey, da, 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 hey. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, my dancing needs improvement. I'm sorry, I'll work on that. <laughs>